What is going on guys, your boy Joey672 coming to you guys with a video right now. So, um, you know, obviously you know, some of the players are coming in the building at the Novacare Complex today that we did sign like Anthony Harris and Adams, uh, Hassan Ridgeway uh, that we did sign and, and that's pretty much about it right now. Uh, but to talk about, you know, Anthony Harris coming here and what he just has done in his career and... Jonathan Gannon, the new defensive coordinator, has been a big part of that. And you know, there's a video, obviously, I'm not going to show it because I don't want to get copyrighted for it, but um, it's on PhiladelphiaEagles.com, and it's on their Twitter as well with some of these players coming up to the building. And with Anthony Harris, Jonathan Gannon must have been a huge part of this just from – he was literally walking into the Novacare. He opened the door, and Jonathan Gannon was coming right to the door, and he was clapping his hands at Anthony Harris, and they gave each other a big hug. So you know there is, you know, obviously they have connection over with the Minnesota Vikings. I think um, in Anthony Harris' developing stage as a safety, I think Gannon was the assistant defensive backs coach at that time for a few years, couple years um, you know, so obviously the, there's a lot of uh, connection with both of these guys. And there's no doubt in my mind that, you know, Anthony Harris and, and Jonathan Gannon, uh, Jonathan Gannon was the main reason, was one, probably one of the top reasons that Anthony Harris um, went, you know, signed with the Eagles um, and, and likes him as a coach. And um, I don't know. I mean, we're going to find out more today. They should have their press conferences today. So I will have videos on those by tonight. Um most likely when those happen, uh, which is pretty exciting because it's nice just to see these players talk. And I can't wait till these coaches talk, especially with Jonathan Gannon, what he's going to do, what, what he's going to do with his defense. He's talked on radio with Dave Spadaro, but other than that, that's pretty much it. But I want to see uh, a full press conference with him, definitely. Um, cause Anthony Harris is, was a total steal for a year, $5 million. And you never know what could happen. You know, he could sign another extension after this year. If he likes it here, if he thinks that the team is running well, the defense is doing good. Um, obviously we're still looking for that other cornerback right now. And we try to get some in free agency. Hopefully we do get somebody sued, but the main reason for Anthony Harris signing here probably this defensive roster but as one of his high points it's got to be Jonathan Gannon being the defensive coordinator um I'm very excited you know it shows that you know Gannon is cared about and he shows a lot of energy and wants to get this rolling in 2021 and I can't be any more excited about it I really can't just the way he's gonna use this defense and just what this defense is gonna turn into we're not just gonna have to rely on our defensive line for a pass rush we're gonna we're actually gonna have hopeful talent in the secondary and uh you know it's gonna be a young defense you know it's gonna be a pretty young defense guys at offense as well it's a new turnaround for the eagles it's a youth movement obviously having veterans is is not a big problem but uh in anthony harris's case when we signed him i was beyond uh excited and and, and really couldn't believe it obviously um, a down year last year for Anthony Harris in 2020, but um, you know there was a lot of injuries. To, you know, they had some rookies in there um, on that defense. A couple injuries did happen around him in the secondary, and you know, obviously wasn't too fair to put it on one guy. Just like Darius Slay had his worst season with the Eagles last year in his career, but between all these injuries, he can't do everything by himself. And Darius Slay didn't have you know a good you know what two. He's only had like two bad games in 2020. So Anthony Harris, the connection with Jonathan Gannon, I could, I just, I want to make a video on this because I thought it was important. You could tell just by, you guys could watch the video as well. You guys could tell that uh, Gannon, I mean, it was like, they were excited to see each other. I mean, it was a really cool thing to see, really cool thing to watch. Um, so a big reason, you know, we're going to hear these press conferences today. Most likely if they're up today, I'll have videos on them tonight. I'll have other videos, uh, one or two other videos probably on tonight as well. So look out for those as want to get a couple videos out today um just some of some of the news and what i think about what's going on with some of these signings so i do appreciate it guys jonathan gannon a huge part of anthony harris and his success as a safety we'll find out so other than that guys i'll see you guys later shakes going up follow slide peace out guys peace